Zeus. Hi, Zeus. Man, how you doing? Uh, doing good. good. Um, I'm so happy to be talking to you guys about this movie. I know I talked to you, I think all of you, uh, on the red carpet uh, two years ago. Uh, since yeah. then, um, how, how does it feel being back to this movie? I mean, it's it's been such an amazing journey for it. I you, Honestly, you look really familiar. I was like, I feel like I've met him. And now that you say it, I'm like, okay, I did meet him. Um, honestly, we shot this film a couple of years ago, but I'm excited to finally see it on the big screen. I'm excited for my family to see it. So, and the audience is going to be super excited to see what's going to happen, who's going to live, and who's not. Yeah. <laughs> what I think? Oh, yeah. yeah. I, think, uh, I think definitely uh, it was not, you know, as she mentioned, we did, we did a film a few years ago, so to see the journey of it grow so much is really a, uh, uh, an example of what it means to be an indie filmmaker, I think, or to be in the indie world making you know, indie movies and telling indie stories uh, that can reach, hopefully, a mainstream audience. You know, it was nice to see how, much, how long it could take, you know, a matter of a few years for it to get to the stage that we are in right now. And it makes, for me, for example, it makes me a lot more humbled, a lot more proud to see it come along this, 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 this distance while most projects either just lose steam or people just shelf it and so on, you know, so very proud moment. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Jordan, would you like to add anything? No, no, go ahead, please. I want to hear your next question. Okay. So um, on the carpet, I, we talked a lot about it, this being a very diverse Hispanic cast of different shades of, and how that affected the movie. But this is, has a lot of very young, young, great talent. How did it feel being around such high-spirited people? This is a treat, really. It was a, it was a blessing because um, when I first came on the set, I was new to, this was my first big part, you know, and it was just being around people who are so just immensely talented and very very caring and giving it was just it was a real privilege for me because people really kind of took me under their wing um and i remember there was a couple of times actually where Cade gave me shot me some really great advice that i actually still i uh, keep to heart today even even now as a, as a writer so it was um there's just a, a great cast i was around and it was just uh just a great part it's just a great great thing in general uh, okay you you have such a great character. I think he's he's very funny, and yet you kind of relate to him a little bit. Oh, what was it like playing that character and and having all that fun while it's a slasher film? It's supposed to be a little bit more scary. Uh, I'll be honest. You know, I I was raised in Brooklyn, so it was. Uh, I'm not gonna act like I brought something super extraordinary to it. You know, it was it was somewhat natural for me to tap into that you know being raised in Brooklyn playing a character who's from more of an uh, an urban upbringing in Los Angeles and I was like oh, okay yeah we're not that far off and having that playfulness that sarcasm was something that definitely stemmed from my own childhood and then being on set playing that I honestly had a blast just doing it every day was fun and even as the circumstances of the story got more serious even that was fun because then because then I kind of brought another side of Brooklyn <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just such in a giggly mood today. <laughs> <laughs> it's I Monday. It's Monday. The sun is out. And I'm just chilling in my living room. What do you want? <laughs> I think your character was great. Um, but you. for all of you, this movie definitely gave homage to a lot of the 80s uh, campy slasher films. Uh, what did you guys most enjoy about doing this project? Um, I think for me, as soon as I found out, like when I was a part of the project, the diverse group, I was like, I'm all about that. I'm all about having a diverse group. I'm, I'm all about, you know, playing these characters and everybody brought something different to the table. Our chemistry was off the chain uh, yes. and everybody worked well together. And I think we really brought it home. So I'm excited for people to see it. Yeah, same with Jordan. I it was my first horror film that I've ever done. I, I you know I've never even known what it felt like to to be a, a character in a horror movie. But after you know being invited onto the onto the set and onto the cast, it, it was a very cool experience, and I was pleasantly surprised. As I mentioned earlier, I, I kind of want to do more horror films. Not that I kind of I definitely want to do more horror films as my career. That's right. Because they're they're a whole lot of fun, and you learn a lot about yourself. Yeah. Yeah, certainly it's when you're when you're 
just being a part of a like a, a story in general that not only you're being a part of a horror film but we're, we're just we're conveying a message of uh of diversity to the world and we're we're kind of just showing that the non-stereotypical roles that a person of color can can play is 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 a possibility and i think we really showed that in this film so and it was just great to be a part of it you know just a great thing definitely it's a good film it's a good watch i can't wait to watch it with with a you know group of my friends maybe on on Zoom or, or something. Uh, how do you guys plan to to celebrate the release of this film? Drive in. Drive right. in. Yeah. yeah. I mean, they're all. It, the movie's going to be released uh, in drive in and theaters this Friday, August fourteenth, uh, and then it's going to be released digitally and on demand um, September eighteenth. Kay's birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Uh, thank you. Thank yeah. You. So, uh, yeah, we're all super excited to see this. My family is really excited. I've never been to a drive-in a movie theater, so I'm excited to to bring out the popcorn and, you know, the chocolate, do what I got to do. <laughs> <laughs> definitely. And uh, this is definitely a different type of uh, slasher film, and I, I enjoy the diversity in it and all, all that. But um, is there anything that you guys are – are very thrilled for people to watch about this film and, and take in. Uh, guys, okay, I'll take oh. that one. Sure. Um, yeah, I mean, I definitely think uh, people are gonna be really excited to see a diverse group on screen. I mean, it doesn't really happen a lot, but I think people are gonna be excited to say, you know what, like my cousins, they're gonna be watching me and they're gonna be like, oh, look, look at Jeanette, she's the lead and she's not in a stereotypical role, you know what I mean? So um, it's exciting to be that example. And I think everybody really is that example for a lot of people. So I'm excited for people to watch it. Yeah, I would say to definitely too, just also the diversity and, and just being uh, just what people are going to see, what type of chemistry as a cast we exude. It's just, you're, you're going to see something so uh, just familiar when it comes to family and, and, and friendship and, and yeah, of course, diversity. It's just, it's, it's just, I can't, just uh, convey that mu like as much as I can, just saying how special it was to be a part of that. So it was certainly just the best part of it. Yeah, I, I definitely, uh, it was definitely really cool to be amongst this uh, group of people uh, because, you know, even though we all look a certain way and everybody looks differently, everybody looks like they, they have a little bit of diversity from different parts of the world, uh, but there's a synergy there and beyond that synergy, the moment everybody speaks, you get hooked onto what their personalities are. You get to focus on who they are as people. Uh, and then it's just like an ordinary American experience. And that, that's one of the things I took mostly from the film and the experience itself. Definitely. Well, congratulations to you guys. This, this film definitely is something I really enjoyed and I think people will as well. Thank you very much for your time. And I hope to see more of you guys in the future. Thank you, Asia. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Have a good one. Guys. Have a good day. Thank you.